Well, guys, welcome to Daylight with Dean, number 242, on December 17th, 2020. We are about to go explore a winter wonderland. My coffee's outside, and Leslie is walking with us. So let's enjoy this winter wonderland together. Welcome to Daylight, Leslie. Hi! It's the most wonderful time of year. It is! And it is her favorite thing in the world whenever it snows. Snow! This way. Snow! So. Alright, putting that down so we can at least walk that far. Yesterday, I spent about four hours out in the snow moving firewood around, getting a flat tire on a log splitter repaired and all sorts of things and I came in after four hours I was freezing love this I was freezing and the first thing Leslie said to me is let's go outside let's go for a walk <laughs> and I'm like I just I just was outside nonstop. Oh, I can't go. So our daughter Abby went. Oh, let's get our first sip of coffee together. And we'll. Well, I can't say it. Le Le this is Leslie's this is third, third cup. I've been up since this five. is this is my first sip this morning. Snow and coffee. Let's go. Okay, we're going to try to keep up with Leslie. She is exuberant. <laughs> oh, it's up to my knees out there. Baby, it's, it's snowy. snowy outside. It's snowy. Okay. So, since I'm carrying the camera, we're going to feature Leslie quite a bit on daylight. Oh, no, <laughs> just talk. And our beautiful neighborhood. I love the way the snow sits on the branches uh, Mickey went somewhere or tried It's like we're living in a snow globe and it's our own snow village Look at the house, look at the house It's like a snow village We're in a snow globe And these are our snowy neighbors Hey snow my son Alex went to work yesterday, and they sent him home early, and he had to drive 20 minutes on Route 28. He's like, Dad, traffic is at a standstill. Should I get off at Harmerville and drive through Springdale the rest of the way? I said, yes. So that's what he did. I'm sure many of you that were out in it yesterday got to experience quite a bit. That's Billy, our neighbor with this snow. Oh. They haven't done what? They did the main road here. Hi! <coughs> So, are you walking on the sidewalk? Yes. She's walking on the unshoveled sidewalk instead of the plowed, plowed road. So pretty. For those of you that watch this June, that's the backyard right where the fire was in my neighbor's shed right there. are our backyard neighbors that look it's out at my it's backyard every time. Now I'm being informed we're walking the other way. So would you mind going first to show us the way? Sorry about all the motion. Uh, 
I love when the snow just yeah. <laughs> You ask what it is about Leslie that brings me joy. I'd have to say just about everything. When we were first married and she was teaching, we lived in a trailer on my parents' property in Delmont. And we, uh, whenever we would have a snow day, she would wake up so excited at six in the morning. There was no going back to sleep. There was no sleeping in. It was all, let's go play. These trees are very pretty. I'd say we were looking at somewhere between eight and 10 inches of snow last night. Feels like more than 10. I often get accused of being a preacher and counting with preacher numbers, so I will try not to add and make it a foot of snow, even though it feels like it. For some of you, this may be your favorite daylight because you don't have to look at my mug the whole time. She's so excited, I can't even keep up with her. My neighbor here, he has a high intensity snowblower at work. Look at that. So my wife teaches, online school has not been canceled. So she is going to be out teaching soon up in our, do you have to go into the school today? Okay. I like trudging through the snow on the sidewalk in my ski pants. She just has her Uggs. She's gonna end up getting snow in her boots. Oh, I see. It's so beautiful. This is our best attempt at daylight. Don't you uh, remember um, when Lori Hetrick told us about living in Minnesota, she's a substitute. And they don't cancel school until it's 20 below zero. And they go to school, and they go out to play, and you bring your snow clothes to school, and that's how it is. That's how it is. That's how they roll in Minnesota. <laughs> Grateful for, since February, all the exercise I've been putting in, so I'm not winded. Able to walk up this hill, talk and hold the camera at the same time. How long do you do daylight? How long would you like me to do daylight today? Yeah. 10, 15, 20 minutes? <laughs> Gosh! Here, let's get us together. Okay. You know you can switch the camera, right? I know I can switch the camera, but then everybody sees Hi. where I've been. Hello. So grateful to be with you all this morning. Hot coffee, beautiful snow, amazing wife. Well, guys, I know for some of you, snow is not your favorite thing, and winter is not your favorite time. So, as we wrap up daylight today, I would like to just pray that somehow, some way, 
you're able to find joy today in the snow. With the snow, for all of you watching that aren't in the snow, I know some of you are thrilled not to be in it, and some of you are longing to be in it. If you're I'm gonna make a snow angel. someplace where there is no snow. So, all right, here we go. Hold on, let's get your hood up. Hold away. Ready? Here's my wife's snow angel. Somebody's yard, we don't even know who it is. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna mess it up. Okay, one, two, three. Let's see it. There it is, beautiful snow angel. Okay. Well done. All right, well, let's pray. Okay. Father, we're so grateful for today. Thankful for the beauty of the snow. Thank you for your blessings and faithfulness. Father, I just lift everyone up here up to you today. I pray that you would bless them. Lord, whether they are living somewhere where there is snow or whether they are living somewhere where it only sunshine 65 and 300 days of the year. I pray, Lord, that you would bless each person today. Keep us safe. We ask, help us make wise decisions about going anywhere. Well, Father, I pray that we would trust you today. I pray that winter will be a time of exuberant excitement and adventure for us and not a season of shutting down and letting our souls wither away. I pray that we will be fully alive and engaged this winter season with you, your love, your faithfulness, your goodness. May we walk in step with your spirit. We're so grateful for your blessings today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Hey, have a great day. Bye-bye.